Welcome to the Files Recovery Tutorial. In this video, I'll show you how to recover deleted files even after the trash was emptied. Let's take a look at an example. I was removing old documents yesterday and accidentally deleted the one I still needed. Unfortunately, I also emptied the trash. Normally, I would have to put up with it, but not with the Files Recovery tool. First, I'll open the Files Recovery and select the place where my lost file was. But there's a whole variety of other devices I can restore data on. USB flash drives, external hard drives, and so on. I'll click Start Scan, and MacKeeper will perform a complete scan of the volume. The progress bar below will inform me of how much time the scan will take. As a general rule, the scan is pretty fast, but if I want to recover large files, or for some reason have to interrupt the scan, MacKeeper will remember the interruption point and resume the scan the next time I open the files recovery. The scan is finished, and here's a list of all the files that can now be recovered from my Mac. I can group the search results by file type. I'll click Documents and preview the files using the Quick Look button to make sure that I found the right file. And here it is. Now I'll click Recover, select the destination where the recreated file will be saved. It must be different from the volume I've scanned, and there must be enough free space to accommodate the file. The recovery process is finally over, so I'll go to the volume that contained the file and make sure that it's back there. Please note that any new files you copy to your Mac can overwrite the deleted ones. Therefore, the chances of file recovery Restoring your lost data very much depends on how long ago those files were deleted. That's it for the Files Recovery Tutorial, and thank you for watching.